All right, y'all, what's going on? What's going on? All right, so today I'm eating me a little, little cute little note loaded nacho. Okay, so if you're new to the channel, please, please, please subscribe to the channel. Go ahead and subscribe. Even if you aren't new, if you haven't subscribed, definitely go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell so you get notifications the next time we post a video. Leave us some comments down below. Let us know things I see us trying, things I see us cook. Interact with us because we do like to hear from you. I'm going to say, guys, and get started. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for this food that we're about to receive for nourishment of our bodies and health. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Anywho, I got uh, my little chipotle chicken, brisket, pico, cheese, both shredded and queso liquid cheese, and then um, sour cream, and I'm gonna get, get my tiger sauce. Got my tiger sauce, and then I use these uh, Kroger guacamole style chips, and um, these salsa verde because I really want to taste both of them. So, mm. I had these before. They taste familiar. And then, uh, mm. these kind of taste fine. Quite good. I can taste a little bit of the guacamole. They're a little spicy too. These spicy? Mmm. I like that. Mm. Hmm. I like a little tiger sauce on my mess food. I don't know about tiger sauce. Get you some. It was all the rave on YouTube like a couple years ago. All the moot bangers was eating it. On every kind. Mostly. Chicken. Or fried foods and tacos. Or Mexican food. But I've tried it on... Um, a lot of stuff, but I really like it on Mexican food because it's like a sweet and spicy sauce. But when I eat it on Mexican food, it brings more of the sweetness out. And I don't know. I just like that. I broke the nail. Trying to put the baby shoes on. I like went like this to try and, you know, get his heel of his shoe in, well, the heel of the shoe like up and the nail came smooth off. I'm sorry because it was one of my favorite ones. Oh, one of the candy cane ones. Um, this brick is so dang all good. It's ridiculous. Mm. All right, eating some of it. <laughs> Eating a couple little pieces of it while I was putting it, put my nachos together. This is a real little basic nacho for me. I usually have way more stuff on there than this, but. Oh, I had some lettuce. Oh, well. Mmm. 
This is all I really wanted to muster up the strength to do. It seems like I got some black beans, but... Oh, well. <laughs> I got, um... Yeah, I tasted the other one with y'all, the rest in peach. I was in five and below. I mean, five below. Why do we say five and below? It's five below. Um, and they have singles. They have a single sparkling water, and they had the single the tea. Now, y'all know I said I had. I said I wasn't gonna try the sparkling water. Why do it? Why did I try it anyway? Curiosity got the best of me, and it was just as dumpster-sized trash as I thought it was going to be. Because I knew, uh, because it's not that sweet, I was like, oh, I know the sparkling water ain't going to be sweet, and it wasn't. <laughs> no, I, I definitely can put some... Um, and I'm going to put a little bit of sugar like I did that one from Trader Joe's and it's going to be great. But I knew it was going to be trashy, but I decided to take a chance anyway. Mm. I think more so, now they do have the singles at Kroger, but I wasn't interested in it, but getting it, but... Because I was going to say maybe it was because it was singles, but no, they'd be having the individuals in there. Sparkling water more than they have the um, the tea. Oh. Whatever. I'd be liking it. I eat, do you, what? Is there a method to y'all nacho eating? I like to eat the edges first. And work my way into the center where all of this stuff be at. Even though I do, I mean, I pretty much look, I load mine up, so it be stuff everywhere. But when you be going to restaurants, they just be having the stuff in the middle. So I eat around the edges so that. Well, that left is the good stuff, because if you eat all the good stuff, then ain't number chips left. Well, you're going to take it home. You're going to take the chips on, you're going to take the chips off. Don't worry about me being a big bat. Don't even trip. I finally finished um, the latest ep or latest season of the uh, show You, While You, on uh, Netflix. Because, man, it just, this. why did it take seven and a half episodes for it to start getting good for me? Like, it was hard to watch, man. And... That just made me think about the show, which I didn't think I thought about it later on in the day. But um, made me think about the lady who uh, I, th I told y'all a minute ago. She passed away on my team. Well, not on my immediate team, but like our broader team. Because me and her, like when it came, we was talking about it in the summertime. And that was a comment of ours. She, well, she told me to keep watching it. She said it did get good. I'm pretty sure she told me to keep watching it. Because I think she, I think she was done. But we talked about how it was slow. It was hard to watch.
and we were talking about how you shouldn't we shouldn't like him because he literally is a serial killer like going around killing people but you can't help but to like him joe that is But I will say I like Bearded Joe better. Bearded Joe is a snack, okay? Bearded Joe is daddy, okay? Because at the I, I'm not gonna spoil it and say what happened. Just at the end, by the end of the season, he had cut his beard off. He had was growing a beard, and he cut it off. I was telling my siblings that I had finished watching it, watching it. My brother was like, I don't even remember what happened. Was it only seven episodes? I don't even remember. It was so like beginning of this year. Yes, it was. But again, it took me a while to watch. So. By being since the last couple episodes last night. Because it did get interesting. Joe, a piece of work, boy, I tell you, though. This one is a uh, armless palmer, is what it's called. Excuse me. Tell me he's time for lunch tomorrow, but I don't know if I'm be here with him. Young guy broke a. I don't want to necessarily say he broke it. It just came off like a bracket unattached itself from his tooth. Unattached itself from his tooth, and then he called me today to tell me that it had came out of his mouth when he was brushing his teeth. It ain't, it ain't happened to me. I don't think the bracket ever came off. I think something happened to my wire one time, though. I think the wire came out somewhere or something. But man, I just... Who thought it was a good idea to have these kids getting braces at this young age? They just not, they're not responsible enough. Young guy left his water pick at my house. Dude literally leaves something everywhere he goes. What's your kid? What, what's the thing that your kid do that drive you up a wall? And the thing is, I go to a checklist. And I'm like, you got this. You got this. You got this. And he sat there in my face and said, yeah. Cause I know I specifically asked if he had his water pick and he said yeah dear. So we pull up to his daddy house. And as he getting out the car, this dude start patting the bag. How that's gonna tell you what's in there? But patting the bag because he knew had he had realized that he left the water pick. 
But it was the bag pad for me that just was like, dude, you knew dang. Like, what is the bag pad doing? You know that too. You know it's not in there. And, uh, excuse me. You can't just pat the bag and think you're going to find it. You know what? Yeah. Got on my nerves and carrying on. But I know I was going to have to see him again at some point this week anyway because what's well, my son. But I knew he was going to have to do this this uh, appointment to get the bracket fixed. But he stay he ain't been eating stuff that he ain't supposed to eat. But what am I to say? on a little paperwork that I had to sign like basically he had like enter into an, a, a patient agreement that we're going to follow the rules of the treatment plan otherwise my man might could just continue the service now all my money will be have been wasted we're just not going to have that Mm -mm 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 -mm. <laughs> Today was the uh, first day back to work for me. Uh, it was a busy man. I mean, long stop. I have this thing that I have to do on the first of the first day of every month, and then my team has to start filing our quarter in and year in filings. Here to see my like, everybody was pinging me today, like messaging me, like my leader. I'm going to want to have a meeting. Uh -uh. On the first of Monday, I said, no, not on the first of the Monday. She's like, was I infringing on your first of the month thing day? I was like, yeah. And and the team with the quarter end stuff having to get them started. So it was just a lot. I couldn't do it. I was, I did take one meeting today. I mean, but I couldn't do it. Okay. Divert my focus, really. And then home dude that uh he I guess it's because we accounting, okay, that the accounting department has to book these entries and expenses for this guy. Okay. But home is gonna be doing his job. So I'm gonna make my job more. And
Now I'm just thinking about something that is gonna just, <laughs> it's gonna cause such an issue. Uh, oh, he's a really cool dude. He cracks me up. Actually, he had asked about something and I had gave him an answer. He was like, sound, he said, as the kids would say, it sounds sus. I was rolling. Because the kids do say that, gotta be saying that. He is funny. He's just, he's, the, the, the guy is actually pretty funny to me, but he just. Well, it's supposed to just be like a little sad responsibility thing. Turned into so much more, okay? But ain't nobody gonna take it from me, though. But, I mean, I, I like having it because it's something different, but it just caused so much headache. I don't want to deal with it. When it's good, it's good. When it ain't, it ain't. It ain't, child. Everybody be looking at it. don't even know what's going on, but they want to cause a ruckus and a scene and everything. You know, my nerves are carrying on. I'm black. I'm the one. Alright. Well. Bad, bad. Oh, excuse me. That is it, and that's all, y'all. I am cool, and I'm ready to go to sleep. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. Leave some comments down below. Let us know things you like to see us try, things you like to see us cook. Interact with us, because if you like to hear from you, and subscribe to the channel. Go ahead and subscribe. And hit that bell so you get notifications the next time we post a video. We'll see you in the next one. Peace out.